this one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. PSV have chosen to go 4-3-3. Jim, how do you see it? Well, a system promoted by the rise of total football, Peter. The wider players in the front three are, are key operators in how it all works on and off the ball. They have to provide for the central striker, of course, and protect their fullbacks, so they'll get few breathers. If these two don't make a good impression, there are quite good replacements on the bench. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Looks to dink one in. He's got options out wide. Trying to get there. There are a few waiting for it. Tries to get it forward quickly. Played out to the right. Going through. Gets it into the middle. That intervention was very necessary. Now it's Giroud. Giroud! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. They've played it short. Well, it's very much the start we expected. There is a sizable gulf in quality between... Up to meet it! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. And it's played forward. Milan are taking a simple, modern approach here. Yeah, but I'm all for simplicity, Peter. If it works, it's good enough. Fired in. Knocks it away. Van Ginkel. Hoists it forward. PSV still without an attempt on target. Al Ghazi. Cross deflected behind for a corner. And that's been lever clear. Battles to win it back. Tries to switch the play. Forward it goes. And here's Luke de Jong. De Jong spreads it towards the left. Play for a throw. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. it over to the other flank 
Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Ball's out on the left now. Goes for the cross. Great leap! Good delivery, but no joy. PSV can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Looking crossfield, changing the point of attack. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. Raheem Diaz, and here's it's Giroud. Oh, that is very close. Giroud brilliantly took control of that, which was exactly what the situation required. Gets it back. Across the field it goes. Al Ghazi. Al Ghazi. And here's Luke de Jong. And it's Van Ginkel. Had a shot. Al Ghazi. And it's look. And there is the half time whistle. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goalless. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Yeah, and despite the scoreline, it's clear who the better side is when it comes to chances. If this is the trend that's going to continue, then there's only going to be one winner here, and uh, I don't think it's going to take too much improvement for it to happen. No goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. Here we go again. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped. Lots of effort, but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone can step up and produce something a little more magical. has gone out Brahim Diaz Brahim Diaz, and here's Giroud. Kings it out wide. Tries to get it clear. Now it's Luke de Jong. That's found its target. Finds himself eased off the ball. Chip through, and that'll go straight through to the keeper. Ogazi, and it's played forward. Tried to play it through. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Tries to get it forward quickly. Hoists it forward. Done very well to intervene. And it's Al Ghazi. 
Now it's Luke de Jong. It's on a play. He's gone for it. Oh, that's a fine save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Deftly done. Oh, nice touch. Can he deliver? Gorgeous control there. Hurls himself at it. And he heaves it forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Nil nil the score, and we're just about done. A deeply frustrating game. We get a throw in. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Brahim Diaz. Hernandez. And it's played forward. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Brahim Diaz. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. And here's Ibrahimovic. Ibrahimovic! No, not quite. A oh, good play all round. He was well hustled and, and still got a shot away. Look at the changes then in quick succession. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. Forward it goes. Out to the right. Oh, that's neat. Well, that's a foul, free kick's been given. Come loose. Hits one. Surely this time. No mistake. Listen, I've experienced that both for and against, and you won't have to guess which one I preferred. Oh, whose goal is that? Big deflection. That's one for the dubious goals panel. Well, it's an inspired substitution. Terrific move by the boss. That's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect. What an introduction. Milan take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, it's been their hard work that has got him this lead, but I just wonder whether they can keep it up. This may take a toll now. Looking for space out wide. And he just whacks it away. They are right into last chance territory. TSV have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Can't get the better of his opposite number. 90 minutes up, we're into stoppage time. They're playing as if time is on their side when it's it's fast running out. They've got to quicken this up. Van Ginkel drives it forward. 
So that's it. It is all over. One goal settled it. A tense and exciting game that just got away. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Well, look, it was certainly a lot closer than I expected.